Hi, movie buffs, from Tom Cruise to Brad Pitt, from Jennifer Aniston to Adam Sandler, lots of big movies with big stars to choose from this holiday weekend. But there's only one pick of the week. We'll talk about that later. First, let's talk about bedtime stories. Skeeter. Aniston's friend, Courtney Cox, co-stars with Adam Sandler in Bedtime Stories. I'll do it. But Skeeter's life is about to change when the bedtime stories he tells his niece and nephew start to mysteriously come true. Tell us the bedtime story. Sandler is still lovably goofy, but this Disney production lacks one important ingredient for this film to work. Magic. And for that, Bedtime Stories gets two and a half sleep on it kisses. Another movie out this week, the also oh cute Marley and Me. Wow. Based on the best-selling autobiographical book by John Grogan, Owen Wilson and Jennifer Aniston star as a couple who adopts a neurotic but adorable puppy named Marley. Stop it! Marley and Me is a tad formulaic, but pet lovers and newlywed couples looking for the meaning of life may love the movie. Oh yeah, bring lots of tissues. And for that, Marley and Me gets three Labrador Retriever kisses. We've been hearing about this movie, Tom Cruise in... Valkyrie. Contrary to popular belief, Valkyrie is not that bad, but it's not that good either. What I said was much worse. The plan to assassinate Hitler is the main plot of the film, with Tom Cruise as Colonel Klaus von Stauffenberg, the ringleader. Directed by Brian Singer, Valkyrie is beautiful to look at, but lacks the necessary tension and suspense for the film to take flight. And for that, Valkyrie gets two and a half, The Death of Hitler Kisses. So my pick of the week, no other than the heartfelt, The Curious Case of Benjamin Button. My name is Benjamin, Benjamin Button. This is one of my favorite films of 2008. Brad Pitt's performance as a man who ages backward is one of the year's best. Director David Fincher crafted a film that wisely used melodrama as a tool to adapt the darkly funny short story by F. Scott Fitzgerald. But maybe not. You're odd. For that, The Curious Case of Benjamin Button gets four young and old kisses. So there you have it, movie buffs. Watch The Curious Case of Benjamin Button. I'm Manny the Movie Guy. Always have fun at the movies. <laughs>